My name is Bojana Zakalujna. Hi, my name is Vyacheslav Hilashenko. Uh, so, um, my name again is, um, I'm coming from Ukraine, from Lviv. Um, I'm the I'm director of uh, Jan Factory Art Center. Uh, connecting these words, ja factory and art, means that I'm dealing with transformation of industrial buildings, uh, and um, I'm in charge of creating a new industrial space, um, a, a new art center in former industrial space. Um, Reusage of uh, buildings um, is relatively new topic, uh, especially in Ukraine. Um, it um, has no more than 10 years. Um, um, the, the approach to transformation um, instead of uh, demolishing buildings has a lot of um, uh, purposes there. So uh, um, it is known that um, uh, reusing buildings uh, brings uh, new values like uh, environmental, uh, social, uh, and economic. Um, so, and as well, we connect to the history, to the past, uh, by creating new values. Um, I will tell you a little bit about the place um, uh, and the space which I'm dealing with. Uh, in the city, um, a, a more than 800,000 inhabitants uh, in the northern part of the city, um, there are a lot of industrial spaces. Uh, and um, uh, in the city that is known um, of being um, a cultural, uh, um, um, a that has a lot of culture, but rather traditional culture, there is uh, no um, a space for um, um, contemporary art. Um, the building that you can see in, in the image um, um, has quite an old history. Um, uh, it is known as the Jam Factory Art Center, uh, but people forgot about this uh, building that actually originally in the 19th century, it used to be uh, a Jewish distillery factory. Um, and um, um, the building, is, um, as you can see, is um, in this um, looks beautiful, but in a way, um, it is falling apart. Um, in, in most of the property in, um, in Ukraine is, um, is private. Uh, and um, st uh, in 2008, this building been purchased uh, by a local businessman. Uh, but um, um, due to economic crisis after 2008, it was really hard to deal with the property. And an owner allowed art organization um, to come there and create art. Um, it was a space of freedom to create um, contemporary art and bring something to uh, the city. Um, so as you can see, a lot of international artists, mainly from different um, um, uh, countries and that bordering uh, Ukraine uh, came and had contemporary art weeks there. Um, so in uh, 2014, um, I've been one part of the group of people that, uh, that approached the building and started thinking uh, what we can do with the building and that we know that we need a space uh, uh, for contemporary art in our city. Um, and we created a plan um, what we want to you to this building to be. Uh, so we analyzed uh, actually the neighborhood and we saw that a lot of what kind of problems are there uh, and uh, what actually we dream about. Um, uh, in uh, 2015, um, uh, a person that um, a Swiss uh, that has one uh, um, organization that exists more than 10 years in the city actually purchased the building and uh, offered uh, uh, of um, uh, the purchased the building with the intention of creating the uh, art center there. Uh, and I was invited to work with um, Harald Binder Cultural Enterprises. Um, so later on, uh, two years, um, we've been working on the transformation of that building into an art center, contemporary art center in Lviv. Um, the, um, um, 
so the, um, as you might see in, in the building, this is the architectural project. Um, and um, all the complex of buildings are um, go um, going to be transformed into a contemporary art center uh, that deals with uh, different forms of art, uh, music, theater, and uh, visual art. Um, so this will be the biggest um, space in our city for contemporary art. Um, and um, uh, last year we have started um, not um, due to the complex of um, process that we had to pass uh, to transform that building. We have started uh, using um, um, some buildings uh, around uh, for programming. Uh, and we started to deal mainly with Ukrainian uh, artists and had some programming. Um, uh, right now, we are about uh, to start the re renovation, and the Contemporary Art Center will, will, will be open in the uh, beginning of 2021 in Lviv. So, and, uh, as I mentioned, the purpose is to deal with various forms of contemporary art and um, to connect um, and present Ukrainian artists as well, artists uh, worldwide, and present them in our city.